I knew this day would come. I've been taking so many W's over on the Dokkan side of things. Every Ginyu Force unit they release is just W, W, W. Perfect design. Amazing. Of course, Legends comes in. And they said, oh, I see you've been enjoying uh, the Ginyu Force units over uh, on, on, on Dokkan. Let's take your number one favorite character, which matters more than them. Let's just give him nothing. At least is what I've heard. Let me take a look at this for myself. Oh boy, okay. Oh man, <laughs> let's let's get this, okay. What? Holy smokes, I have a lot of stuff open. There we go. Oh, come on, man. There. Okay. So we've got uh, Zenkaid, new epicness <laughs> on the left, and his original stuff on the right. So we've got our main ability, randomly destroys one of your own cards, Draw the ult, 20% health, 50 key, 40% ultimate damage, cannot be cancelled. Reduce damage by 20% cannot be cancelled. So, uh, they literally changed nothing. <laughs> it is the same. They couldn't have bumped up to 25 HP, uh, I mean 25% HP, maybe 60 key, maybe it destroys... Oh no, that's random choice one of your own cards. Maybe add like another effect, like destroys two of the enemy's cards or something. They just said, oh, well, the buffs can't be canceled. Thanks, man. Awesome. That is so, dude, come on. It's main ability buffs. Like, they're not, oh, no, my damage inflicted is going to get, like, no. Come on. Okay. Off to a rough start. Unique ability. Let's see. We got our first passive. Okay. 50% damage inflicted, cannot be stacked, cannot be cancelled, this is when he enters the battlefield. 30% reduced damage received, 15 timer counts, that's long enough for him to be in there I think. Might be a little bit on the short side, I'm not sure. Nullifies attributed downgrades in abnormal conditions for 15 timer counts. Draw a special artist card next, activates once. And here on the other normal side we've got, uh, oh! This is odd. Um, there's no difference. That's crazy, actually. That's crazy how there's no difference except for his damage can't be canceled. <laughs> okay, man. <laughs> All right, let's. Let's. I'm ready to see some some craziness coming up, dude. So far, nothing has changed. Passive number two. I'm tired of listening to you preach. Fr. Uh, third pin damage for the sake. Fusion warrior cannot be canceled. Yup, same. Every time he's faced with an enemy, depending on their battle style. Na 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 na. One level, one level. Da, 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 da. Okay, actually zero difference. Let's see. When you land a strike card, originally he draws another one, gets five key, and he nukes their health restoration. Here we've got uh, draws another one. Activation count resets when characters. Switch, oh yeah, okay. He draws one, restores key by five, nukes their health restoration, and oh my god, nukes their key recovery. Whoa, Jesus. Three timer counts. Okay. <laughs> okay, now we get on to the to the to the fully fully original original stuff. Look at this. Passive number three, the brand new awesome Zenkai passive. When two allies are defeated, you are the last man standing. He gets a whopping 15% health and 10% damage reduction. Oh boy, no difference. This does nothing. You're getting a measly 15% HP? And then a very, very small, small, insignificant 10% damage reduction. If you get caught in a combo, you are probably going to die. Whether this, whether you this passive existed or not, this is probably not going to save you from dying. This does barely anything. Like I don't. Maybe if you get hit by a stray blue card, maybe you can clinch out, barely live. But if you get, if the enemy gets priority, this is not saving you by any means. 
Passive number four, when he evades an enemy's attack with a vanishing step. Okay, we get minus two to strike rates cost for five timer counts and plus 20% of strike damage for five, for five timer counts. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Minus two, minus two to strike arts cost for five timer counts. Nothing. He gains key. He gains key when you hit strikes. This minus two percent literally doesn't do anything. And then just a twenty percent damage inflicted. Du -du 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 -du. Okay. Well, let's see, man. I'm not. I'm not expecting a uh, huge omega changes here. Uh, oops, oops, there we go. Blue card. Inflicts all enemies with a no switching for three time against spawn activation. Very good. The same though. Inflicts enemy without triggering eyes plus 20% damage received. <gasps> oh my god, they increased the percentage on something. No way! Wow, dude. Now they take 20% uh, the attribute downgrade plus damage received, blah blah blah. Instead of 15, oh my boy. At least they, dude, at least, <laughs> why didn't they do this for everything? Like, see, just, oh, 15, bump it up to 20, easy. Why don't, why not just, why not just, oh, 20, bump it up to 25. Oh, 40, bump it up to 50. Like, oh, 50, bump it up to 60. Bump this up to 35, bump this up to 25. Like, just raise the numbers a little. What are you doing? Uh, okay, man. Let's uh, let's let's keep going. Let's keep going. Green card. Green card. You're going boom, smack, pow. You punch them, and it absolutely did not change. Let's go. Did not change. We did not get uh, nullify cover changes at all. This was the spot to put it. This this is where you did it. Literally, like good super dude. He's he. It was. They were, dude, the design, okay, are we, oh, they probably updated the website, um, but basically, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta has a same, similar working green card, dash forward, do an attack, and then on that, for Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, he nullifies, uh, cover changes, he also has blast armor, and but you have to hit it first, right? It's like, oh, okay, he nullifies cover chain, but you have to hit it. And then you have Ultra Gogeta, who just, he has a, just a power-up green card where he just does it. He just does it for free. Power of green card nullifies cover changes. So, you have one, okay, uh, you have one character that literally does the exact same thing as him. You could have just slapped it on. Could have, you could have just slapped it on him. Blast armor. Nullify cover change for 10 counts or something. So simple. It was right there. And there's already a newer character that has a stronger version of this ability. So it's not like you're giving him like the strongest ability ever. You're giving him like the, the less good version of the, the thing. But the, nope. Okay. Yep. Just get strike cover changed. Okay. Just have fun not doing anything. Uh, 50%, 3 counts, 100% for 3 counts, uh, nullify endurance, yep, and then nullify, holy smokes, see, nullify enemy special action, that even not change your cover, awesome, so no changes, no, no changes, Zenkai ability is for blue god key, awesome, dude, blue god key, huh, let's take a look at blue, blue, oh my god, the stupid website, Blue God Key. Uh, I mean, right here we can see that's the uh, the new Vegeta. That's this free Vegeta, who I think was was he in the Goku good? I I know this Trunks is good. I don't know if they were one of the good ones. Uh, Beerus is pretty good. Not you. And yeah, okay, that's it. <laughs> awesome, dude. This, dude, this Revival of Goku is so bad. I actually, dude, thanks, that's epic. Revival of Goku is so bad, I, I literally, I slapped him up I, with my zero star gamma, and he was like, and he was 14 stars. Besides the point, though. Uh, Vegito Blue, Zenkai, um, yeah, he, uh, they didn't change anything. 
they changed virtually nothing. They gave him, they didn't up any stats at all. They, they did two things. They did two things, actually. They, they did, in the entire thing, they did two things. They made some of his buffs un cannot be cancelled. And then they gave him these two, these two passives that don't do anything. They gave him two meaningless, useless passives. What? Okay, so, two, there, there's two, uh, there's two back doors. There's two fail safes to copiums for this one zenkai stats yes his num yes his numbers might not have been bumped up at all basically but his stats are going to be to the moon so we'll have to see how that plays out because he's gonna have a huge amazing awesome stats now so maybe Two, he doesn't have a unique equip. What if they did this? Oh, look, he's mid. They, we didn't add much. And then they add a ton on a unique equipment. Because then you would have to grind that unique equipment. You know Legends loves making you grind and work for things. So that maybe that's why this is so meteor. Because then they're gonna, just going to treat him like, a, like an, an LF that needs a buff. And just give him a crazy unique equipment. Because they very well can do that. Just because it's a Zenkite. And, it, and they didn't add him. It doesn't mean it's game over. Because it, you can just look at his Zenkai self. as just now his new base stat. His new his new base. And if that is weak. And they give him an insane unique equipment. Well there you go. Now we get uh, an, an LF Cell. LF Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta situation again. They can easily do that. But we'll have to see him in game. Maybe I mean he's gonna be decent. We know that for sure because you know even he has a sort of newer age kit. Even though you know like obviously it doesn't compare to stuff now. But it's not like a like he has a pretty developed kit I, I guess. So we're gonna slap on Zenkai stats on that. See how it goes. If it doesn't go, we're gonna wait for his. We're gonna keep demanding his unique equip because that can still save him. No matter what, he can still get a unique equip that can save him, but I could always give him like a Super Saiyan 4 Goku unique equipment or something. You know? Uh, but that's gonna do it for this video. Uh, I'm still hyped. I'm still... I still... Uh, I'm still ready to use Vegito Blue again. Because he's gonna be usable. We know this. He's gonna, he's gonna be, like, usable at least. So, uh, like, subscribe if you enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next one.